Good morning. I am getting ready for the work week, work day. I have to work today. It is freaking cold. It's, <laughs> it's crap in here. Um, I don't know the temperature outside, but um, I know it's freaking cold. I'm going to make me some lentils. Lentils for lunch for work. Um, lentils, what I like about lentils is they only take about 20 minutes to make. So I just did some brief dishes and then I'm going to make some lentils. Lentils and rice. Y'all know I can't live without my rice. So lentils and rice. Just cleaning up real quick the dishes in the kitchen and then I'm gonna lay back down I'm tired I don't have to be at work until 2 it's probably about 7 30 right now in the morning so yeah all right let's get these lentils cooking and then let's get back in this bed actually my work container for my lunch. Actually we need the water. Try to do it for the week. Hopefully, that's enough. It should be. Just kind of rinse them like you would rinse rice without wasting all this water. Sure, ain't nothing in there. No, nope, everything looks good. I just put above water where it's covering the top. to a boil. pretty foggy out today so it's gonna be a really muggy day hopefully it rains we need it
I'm gonna let that come to a boil and then I'll be back on. So I turned my generator on, that's the noise you're hearing because I'm gonna warm up this rice and I'm gonna have lentils and rice for breakfast and then I'm gonna take lentils for lunch. And I'm gonna put some of this um, sriracha mayo over the top just for flavor. And that beep means that my microwave is ready for use. Let's make sure that microwave plate is in the right, which it is not, because I have been driving. There we go. <clears throat> One minute. Okay, generator is off, rice is ready. One serving, and the lentils are ready. Let's turn it off. Been about 20 minutes, a little over 20. But there are the lentils. Eat me a nice big bowl. Well, I am not hungry. Got my water. <clears throat> so that's breakfast, lentils and rice, something simple. Mm. What I like about lentils is they literally take on whatever flavor you give them. They really don't have any flavor. Just take on whatever kind of flavor you give them. It's kind of, the flavor is subtle, but I like it.
Mm. And then I'm going to pack my lunch, which is just going to be straight lentils. Because I'm working two shifts today. I'm working two to ten. Shift. Afternoon shift. And then ten to six in the morning. Midnight shift. So I don't eat on the midnight shift. So the lentils that I eat on the afternoon shift, that'll be all I eat. This and the lentils in the afternoon. And then I'll eat something tomorrow. <clears throat> Either when I get off work or when I wake up from my quick little nap before I have to go in again. Mm. I have a couple more bags of these lentils, but probably going to stock up for the winter. And this is probably what I'll cook during the winter <clears throat> something quick, easy, healthy, protein packed. I've never had the red lentils. I've only had the green. Just a little more. Can someone tell me the difference between red and green lentils? Because I don't know. I've only eaten the green. Just because that's the first bag I ever grabbed. And that was the first time I've ever had lentils was the green. Mm -mm -mm. This is so good. It's simple and it's so hearty. Tofu would probably go good with this. The texture. Hmm. You might try that next time. <clears throat> this is what I've got. It's 8.30. So I think after I eat my breakfast, I'm going to lay back down and go to bed. I'm so sleepy. I'm going to sleep for about another 8.30. Another four hours. Three and a half, four hours. I'm so sleepy. I'm going to get ready to get out of here. I just kind of wanted to show you <clears throat> what a typical morning is for me um, on my first day going back to work. Now, tomorrow, I won't have all this time because I'll get off at like 6 or 7 in the morning. <clears throat> I'll have to drive to where I'm going to sleep. And people ask, why don't you want to sleep in your work parking lot? No. Work is stressful enough. It causes me a lot of stress. I don't want to wake up, go to sleep stressed at a place that causes me stress. Mm -mm. So I don't, the only time I have this much kind of downtime before work, before work is my first day going back to work. Um, after that, like tomorrow, I won't have this kind of time. Like I said, I'll get off at like 7, 7 in the morning. I'll have to drive to my destination. I'll have to take a quick shower. Like I'll, by the time I'm done doing everything, I'll probably have like a couple hours before I have to be back at work. I'll probably get like a couple hours of sleep. I'm lucky if I get three hours of sleep. And that's not me complaining. That's just me explaining what my schedule is like during the work week after my first day back. You know, it's the life I chose to live. No regrets. You know, I'm doing what it takes to achieve a dream of mine. And I'm doing what it takes so that I can travel full time. I can live how I want to live, you know. I'm working the hours. I'm putting in the work, making the content. 
I'm loving it. It's a lot <clears throat> of work, but it's a lot of work making the content, um, working the doubles. It's a lot of work that I enjoy doing because I know what my end goal is. I definitely love making content. Don't I love it. That has just been a dream of mine to live in a van and now I get to live in a van and make content that people actually enjoy. My introverted, boring self, like that's awesome. But as far as working, I do it because it's gonna allow me to do the things that I have planned for myself in the future. So that's why I do that. Hopefully all that made sense. <laughs> I'm still a bit tired. So I'm gonna finish this off and I'm gonna go to bed, get up, get ready for work to start a long six day work week. So thanks for joining me this morning. I appreciate you guys hanging out with me. It means a lot to me. And as always, I'll see you guys in my next video. Take care, peace.